It is sometimes difficult to determine depth in a two-dimensional space. The depth cue feature allows us to add a bit of fog so that parts of the structure further away from the camera are faded or darkened to show levels of distance. In this plan, we'll apply the depth cue to an exterior elevation and an interior elevation. Create an exterior elevation by going to 3D, Create Orthographic View, Cross-Section Elevation, then click outside the structure where the camera should be located and then drag in the direction that it should look. When the mouse is released, the exterior elevation will generate. At this point, the camera is pretty flat. There is no indication that this point here is nearer or farther than this one over here. From the menu, click 3D, Camera View Options, Depth Queue to open the Depth Queue dialog. Put a check mark in Use Depth Queue to enable this feature. Everything kind of grays out. This is because the start of the depth queue is zero inches from the camera's location. We can specify a distance, or we can click and drag this slider to move the depth queue. Notice the start and end sliders move together. This results in one degree of shading that starts at the distance specified. If we uncheck Keep Start, End, and Sync, we can move the start and end separately, which will result in no fade before the start and then a gradient of fade between the start and the end distances. Everything after the end distance is max fog. In this plan, it results in this brown setting to be faded to four different levels. We can increase or decrease the percentage of transparency with this max fog slider. And we can change the color of the fog as well. Switching it to black can make for some striking views. Let's take a look in plan view. If we select the elevation camera, we can see some additional lines and edit handles. This first dashed line is the depth cue start, and further down you can see the depth cue end. We can grab these edit handles and precisely control the location of the cues without having to determine the exact distances from the camera. Depth cue can be used in interior elevations as well. Let's take a wall elevation of a kitchen. Click 3D, Camera View Options, Depth Q. Once again, we have the Depth Q dialog, and we can turn on the Depth Q and adjust the settings to get the desired view.